Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on my channel. If you are new, welcome. My name is Emily. In today's video, I don't really know what I'm doing, basically. I'm sitting here and hauling all the bits that I've picked up recently and I can just pop them away in my wardrobe and it's done. Um, so yeah, I thought I would go through a few different bits that I've picked up. I picked up a few items in the Zara sale because a lot of the things that I found in the sale uh, they wanted to pick up like back in summer but they were just like too expensive and I thought well if I'm only going to wear it a few times then it's not really worth it. A lot of things just went off the website because they'd like sold out or whatever and yeah there's a lot of summer stuff on there and I've picked up a few bits knowing that me and Lewis will be going on holiday in June and I just wanted to pick up a few bits on the cheap basically it's literally probably to be honest a lot of the prices were like a tenner like 9.99 for the majority of the things that I picked up and I'm just going to go through some of them so the first item I'm going to do like the expensive one get it out of the way I caved and I got the Couture Club tracksuit set it is a men's tracksuit however it fits fine there's just like a tiny bit of um like a crotch extra material because obviously I am not a bloke but yeah I picked this up it's such good quality quality material like I'm obsessed with it I want to wear it everywhere I've worn it so many times already I wore it to Demi's last weekend I went, went shopping on Saturday and then I took another tracksuit just to wear the Sunday to come home in um but yeah I actually found I'm sorry my hair keeps going in my mouth um, I actually found the jumper on ASOS for £65. On the actual website, the jumper's £80. I'm not too sure why there was a price difference. Because um, it seems to be like no difference with the materials or anything. And from what I've seen online, it's exactly the same as what I've got. So yeah, this is the jumper. I picked up the jumper in a size small. It's a really good quality like knit. I really want another colour in it. I want the grey or the black now. And then, as you can see, I do also have the bottoms. The bottoms I did pick up in a medium, just because I thought they'd probably fit nicer. I do have quite a long body and I do like my stuff high-waisted. So I picked up a medium. They fit really nice, so that is that. And me and Lewis and did outfit pictures the other weekend. And it was a really cold day and everything I was wearing, like jeans, leather pants and everything, they were quite cold but when I put this on because we walked to Bill's because we went and had some dinner at Bill's before we came home put this on and there was literally like no wind getting through it which I found really bizarre because obviously it's a knit material but yeah that is the first expensive purchase the top is 80 on the website or 65 on ASOS I just put the reminders on because there was like one in stock or something so I signed up for notifications and then the bottoms were 75 so it's a very expensive set However, I literally don't want to take it off my back, but here we are, <laughs> without knocking the camera over. I don't really know in what order to do this, I'm going to save that for when I come to my Zara bits. So, the next item, obviously if you do watch my channel or follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I've got some crazy obsession with the colour red since getting off the virgin cruise in august well september last year and i got another pair of red trainers i have in fact picked up another pair of red trainers these are pink red beige and brown and white so they have quite a lot of colours to them i am absolutely obsessed with these these are like the valentine's day colourway i suppose the pink and the red and I can't stop wearing these at the moment I absolutely love them the only issue is you'd have to be careful in wet weather because the red on here is like a suede the white is a leather the tick is a leather but the red is a suede so I do think they will like stain if you will um but how cute are they absolutely love these these are my favorite item 
at the moment I actually did wear these to Demi's as well last week with my tracksuit that I just showed because obviously the beige and the brown on the back goes well then we do actually have a before Christmas purchase here this is a dupe it's not real it is a replica item a fake if you want to you want to say that it is the is it Loewe? Loewe, I think. I don't know. It's one of these t-shirts and I just really liked it. It's from Inspired Edition. I've worked with them quite a few times on items like for content on Instagram. And I actually picked this up myself, paid for it myself. And I've worn it quite a few times. I am not a t-shirt lover. But this apparently is a new go-to item for me. I absolutely love it. Um, I think this was £45 and it is one size fit all. So, yeah, I'm excited to wear this in summer. I think I'm going to tuck it into some like denim shorts. I can wear them trainers. And then I've got a bag that I'm going to share with you in a second um, that will go with the trainers. But yeah, I just thought they, well, that was really cute for like now. We have sequin skirts and stuff like that, or skirts and boots and tights. So I have styled it quite a few times. But yeah, it definitely will come in handy over the summer period as well. Then the next item that I've picked up, I have just done a, like an unboxing video on it. I'm going to put my cushion up here because it's driving me insane. Um, so yeah, I have just done an unboxing video which you will already see on my channel. It is just the Marc Jacobs Micro Bucket Bag in red and obviously me and red things. I'm obsessed at the moment. So yeah, I don't have a red bag. This is my first red bag. And yeah, I'm manifesting a Virgin Cruise this year because I want to do another one. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. Me and Demi absolutely had the best time of our life with Lewis and Sean. And I would love to do another one. And especially now that I'm vlogging, I can vlog it and bring you all along because it was such a good experience. If there's one holiday you will ever book, it is a Virgin Voyage. 10 out of 10. And this is the bag to manifest another. <laughs> then moving on, I have some items from Pretty Little Thing. So I just thought I would quickly include them in this video. I have some jeans. So these are the Pretty Little Thing tall light blue wash high rise boyfriend jean. They are in a size 10, they are, they are a little bit big. Um, and I do need to cut the bottoms of these because they are very long um, but they are really nice I have just done some content in them for Instagram so that will be coming soon you will see them but I just really like the colour of the blue um, so yeah that's just these jeans I really want to get them waist taken in but do I just get a size 8? I'm not sure we'll see about that but yeah that is just the jeans I definitely do need to cut the bottoms of them, the hem, which I'm not a huge fan of doing, but yeah. Then we have a little cord and it is just like a knit set and I thought I picked up the beige but apparently I picked up the olive. Hey ho. Khaki, sorry. Maybe on the website it just looks a lot beige. <laughs> Uh, so this is like the little crop top to go with it, it's long sleeved, it is a ribbed knit material. This is in a size medium and it is quite big but then if I'd have got a small I think it would have been too cropped because I do have quite a long body. And then we have the matching bottoms, these are just khaki knitted split hem flare trousers. These are also in a, also in a medium and they fit quite nice. So again, these are ribbed knit and then it has, you can see the little cut out. So obviously your foot will sit here and then they go around your shoe. I have styled these for Instagram as well. So that will either be up or coming up. <laughs> then next we have like my favorite item I think so far. Well, I say item, it's not an item, it's a cord. <laughs> So this is just a cream cord from Pretty Little Thing. To be honest, I think they've tried to copy the Zara one. Um, I still have the Zara bottoms and the bomber jacket. I prefer the bomber jacket for this, but I don't think they're going to end up matching. My joggers are on Depop because they're just not long enough for me. 
So these are the pants. These are a size medium. I am a size medium. These are more like an extra large. I'm really sorry but it is what it is. I wish I'd just kept the small in my basket but I thought no the small might be too small because pretty little thing sizes are very random. Very 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 random. Anyway they are like a wide leg, jog leg jogger and they are full length. They are very long just to throw that out there they are very long and I would suggest sizing down one or two sizes for these. I didn't expect the length to come up on me the way that they did. They have done, I'm very happy about it, but I do have to roll the waistband over like this, just so they're not like fully dragging on the floor. I mean, they do still drag a little bit, but yeah, I really like these. As much as the sizing has thrown me off, <laughs> I do really like them. And then we have the matching jacket. Again, this is in a medium. I'm glad I picked it up in a medium. Could have got away with a small, to be honest. But it is quite a lot thinner than the Zara one. So just do just bear that in mind. If you want the same quality and thickness, you're not going to get it. The only thing that's annoyed me is it's come with a stain on already. I don't know if that's going to pick up on camera because of the ring light. Um, definitely. Can you see? I think it's like there. You can kind of see it here. Like, why, why is it coming with a stain on? But anyway, I like the full set and yeah. Then we have Zara. So, I actually picked up quite a few bits from Zara. So, first little set that I picked up is just, it's like, I don't know if it's like um, a pyjama set. It wasn't advertised as a pyjama set when I found it, it was advertised as a cord. So it is like this top with a little underlining bralette in it. <clears throat> and then it sticks out down here. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen me style it the other week at Demi's. And then the shorts have this waistband to match the detail on the top. And I actually picked this up for holiday for Mexico. I thought it would look really cute in on holiday with some sandals and a little bag and this is going to be like a little evening outfit for me and it was just like casual but still a little bit dressy because it's like silk material and I've actually I've ended up with two of these so I've got the shorts in a medium and a large and then I've got the top in a medium and a large I prefer the top in the medium I prefer the bottoms in the large currently but I am losing weight for holiday so the mediums might end up fitting like the large by the time I get to it so I think I'm gonna keep both sets and then just sell a large top on Depop because I've not had a chance to return it. Might get chance I'll have a look on the app <laughs> and see but the top was 9 99 and the shorts were 9 99 and then when I reordered the smaller size the shorts were still 9 99 and the top had gone down to like 5 99 maybe um so for that little set that's quite cheap isn't it considering it should have been like 25 quid per item I think I was actually going to pick that top up for holiday over in summer and I just didn't bother. Glad I didn't because I now have the little cord. I could probably take this on another holiday if I book anything else this year as well. Then another thing that I picked up, obviously you will see a theme of it all being like holiday wear. They just were really cheap in the sale. This is, I, so I really like dresses and stuff in summer but I just can't find that I work and wear them properly just don't like love them because I always find itchy nails. I always find that my bum's out like they just never make because I have quite a long body I find. I always find that they come up too short because my body's taken the material. So I really love jumpsuits and like little play suits, well not jumpsuits but play suits and this is a play suit from Zara. This was in the sale I actually saw this in the shop when me and Louis went the other week. We went on our anniversary because Louis wanted to get a coat for snowboarding. So I actually saw this in the store. I knew it was online, I had it in my basket, as I did everything else here. But I just wanted to see if they had it in the store before I purchased online. And this was in the store and they only had an extra large. Oh my god. So they only had an extra large in the store and yeah, it's not going to fit, it's going to be too big. And anyway, on the price tag, it was 19 99 And then I went on the app to Lewis and I was like, oh, I'll just check that they still got it in stock online. It was 15 99 on the, on the app. So I was like, well, I'm not going to pay 20 quid here and I can get it for 15 or 16 
and it is just this black play suit and it ties obviously I am wearing black so it's going to be hard to see but it, like these are like the booby holders and then the back comes down like this and then it has some more straps here I don't know what these are for to be honest I think they are just to tie the back a bit tighter to keep the boobs up and then the best thing about it is it is a play suit so it hides your bum and everything which I really love that so it was well it should have been 29.99 I did pick it up in a size large yeah so it should have been 25 quid but I ended up getting it for like 16 quid which I thought was quite good and obviously that would be nice on holiday with some sandals I could even wear it in the evening dress it up with a bit of jewellery and a little cute bag or I could just use it like on top of my bikinis and stuff in the daytime then another item I actually wanted these a few a few months back but I just never bothered to get them I got these in a large they should have been £22 but I think I ended up getting them for 9 99 and it is just these crochet shorts I'm glad I did pick the large up I do have quite chunky legs and my bum takes a lot of material um but yeah these will be cute for like wearing around the pool or anything or I could even style these again in the evening with a cute little maybe like silk top bralette um some sandals because I'm hoping well I will have lost weight by the time we go on holiday so these will probably look cute as an evening outfit by the time we get to that point um or I could even style them in summer with like a little black beige top and my Audemars blazers with some sandals too so I think they will come in handy quite often and then I think this is the last item so obviously I ordered two of the sets one came which was the large and I preferred the bottoms and then I just ended up going back on the Zara website and I thought I'll just have a quick quick look um, and I actually saw this dress so this dress should have been 35 quid online uh, well it should have been 35.99 picked up a medium and it's just this crochet dress I'm annoyed that this doesn't have a lining but hey ho the rest of the dress actually does which I was surprised at and it's just a long maxi crochet dress with a cut out back so it will be harder to wear a bra so I might even wear like a black bikini top underneath it because obviously the dress is black I could wear it for daytime I could wear it for an evening first with some sandals again and a little cute bag I am trying to be more like basic if you will on my holiday outfits this year we are going to Mexico it is quite a dressy resort so I think I'll have a mix of nice little cute outfits some others as well and because we are going for two weeks I'm trying to pick things that I can wear in an evening and then afterwards I can rewear during the daytime and get more wear out of it so I'm not taking an excessive amount of stuff because I do tend to overpack. I do actually need a new suitcase as well. I probably should have looked for one in the Boxing Day sales, but I just haven't done. Um, I completely forgot to be honest. But yeah, that is everything that I have currently picked up at the moment. I was gonna share a Zara card, but I don't actually think it's still online anymore. So I'll just leave that out. <laughs> um, but yeah, that is just everything I've picked up. I think my favorites are definitely the trainers and the knit set. I'm not coming towards holiday outfits just yet so we'll hold off on them <laughs> but yeah I hope you all enjoyed watching I hope you all like comment subscribe and yeah I'll see you all again in another video